The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. In a few weeks, school hallways will be filled with students. First grade teacher Bridget Gaines says she is anticipating a new school year with new incentives. That's really exciting and every anything that teachers can get is always, you know, wonderful. Wednesday morning, Governor Rick Scott tweeted a new teacher debit card. The card is a part of a classroom supply assistance program, allowing teachers to spend up to $250 on items for their classes. The card will be distributed in the upcoming weeks. This is cut down on some of the costs that I have to spend out of my own pocket. As teachers get ready to go back to school, the teacher debit card comes at a perfect time as this weekend kicks off the sales tax holiday weekend. John Fleming with the Florida Retail Federation says the sales tax holiday will generate an estimated $400 million for the state. And that's an added increase in retail sales that you would not see without a tax holiday, we think. So it's a pretty big boost for retailers and it's a good uh, bargain for Florida's families. The sales tax holiday has been in place since the late 90s with a two-year hiatus in the late 2000s. The sales tax holiday applies to clothes, school supplies, and for the first time, computers. That's a pretty significant tax savings that you'll be able to get this weekend. Remember this, there are price caps on the sales tax holiday. You can only spend up to $75 on clothing, $15 on school supplies, and $750 on computers. In Tallahassee, I'm Matt Horn reporting.